Go. Hello. Today we want to talk about how to clip nails in a cat. Now we chose this kitty because she is nice and calm. Of course, some cats are a little bit more reluctant, but it is not that difficult and uh, we'll go into details. Now there's three uh, tools that are commercially available. This one here is called the guillotine clipper because it has a blade that ri rides over that ring and clips the nail. These ones were probably the first on the market. They're good. They are not my preference right now. Then there's the big ones. Um, probably they are best for larger animals' nails, like dogs. And my favorite ones for cats are those little scissors, even pink today, for clipping the nail. And I'll show you how that works. First of all, a little anatomy lecture here. The nail comes from the pad. And inside the nail is the so-called quick, which is that area where the blood supply and the nerve is. So when you clip a nail, you definitely must not clip as short to clip the uh, quick and leave a few millimeters of margin between the quick and the nail tip. So if I cut off here, I'm going to have a nice short nail without doing any harm. It's similar to our... Now cats have five nails in the front. This one here would be the thumbnail. And as you can see, the quick the blood supply goes to about here. So if I clip that nail, I'm definitely going to make sure I have a few millimeters of margin left. Just like this. And it doesn't hurt. Older cats have a slightly different shape of nails. They grow some excessive tissue down here, which becomes really thick uh -huh. and just breaks off like onion peels. Once that's peeled off, you just clip the nail in the same way and maybe just clean off all these little older crusts. This nail is clipped nicely. As you can see, it's really not that difficult, but if you feel in insecure at home, we'd love to show you. Just come in, we'll do some demonstration live with you, and then I, I'm pretty sure you'll be very successful doing that at home. Thank you.